President, the COVID-19 pandemic has caused severe disruption to the energy sector. The pandemic is far from over. Many uncertainties remain and crucial energy policy decisions have yet to be made. I commend IRENA for maintaining the focus on the work program and development analytical products that have helped countries to design economic stimuli and recovery packages. You have clearly been a leading voice in renewables in these troubling times. To support IRENA's work, Norway has entered into a new voluntary contribution agreement, providing more than 2 million US dollars per year for 2020 to 21. COVID-19 affects all of us. Despite this, the renewables energy sector in Norway has fared relatively well. Through economic stimulus packages, support has been included to energy-related activities and new strategies. A few months ago, Norway launched a major carbon capture and storage project, the Longship project. A floating wind power plant, High Wind Tampen, is now under development to provide electricity to two oil field operations in the North Sea. Before the summer, the government will put forward a white paper to the parliament on long-term value creation and industrial development based on our energy resources, addressing, among others, offshore wind, hydrogen and CCS. Increased use of electricity and hydrogen from clean energy sources is necessary in reaching the new climate targets. Norway has an excellent starting point. 73% of our total energy consumption is covered by renewable energy, in large power part hydropower. As the transport sector is key in the transition to come, I am pleased to note that in 2020, as much as 54% of new cars sold in Norway were electric vehicles. Furthermore, the government just presented the proposed path on how to reach Norway's 2030 climate targets. A key proposal is to gradually raise taxes on greenhouse gas emissions to about 190 euros per ton CO2, equivalent by 2030. Finally, Norway is honored to be nominated to the Council for the next two years. We are looking forward to be a constructive partner in moving IRENA's work forward. Thank you.